Give me your bravery. Thank you. Get back in the corner, please. And then give me your life. It's just that easy, fellas. Anyone tells you Grand Blue Fantasy Versus Rising is a difficult game? Oh, it's so hard. Oh, I'm stuck in S+. Just Raging Strike them twice in a row in the corner, and it's a guaranteed win every time. I don't see the problem. Objection! Are you going to do the Aura Aura thing? Ah, oh, shit. Okay, okay. And we're back. We got more Grand Blue Orange Square. We won. Uh, we 2-1 we, we every single set that we played, I think, last time. But the game still did not deign to give us our pink square back. Maybe one day, maybe one. We, we did go on a pretty prodigious losing streak there in S+. So, Oh, play uh, Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3. You know, Zeta, I have never actually played that game. That is probably one of the best fighting games that I have never touched. Um, and, I, you know, Dragon Ball Fighters was my first fighting game. So, I'm sorry. I'm sorry if this, like, if, if this offends anyone terribly, but they're, like, kind of similar games, right? They're both versus games. They're both full of, like, a bunch of... Uh, just crazy bullshit that's completely unfair and there's too much shit on the screen for you to see what's going on so I, I, i'm not saying that i would i would fit right in in uh, in marvel 3 i mean honestly it's been a while since i played fighters and it was my first fighting game which uh, if any of you are have picked up uh if you're new to this fighting game for example you know that your first fighting game basically means that you're not very good at it and i definitely was oh right you can yeah yeah you can do some nasty stuff with her pogo hops there i definitely was not very good at fighters uh maybe 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 i'll i'll, I'll revisit it someday and we can see but back in the day it was you know, yeah, that hmm, that pogo stuff is uh, is awfully spooky, huh? And she's just like plus, regardless. That doesn't seem very nice of her. Nice. Yeah, you spend your bravery. Uh, Zeta has a parry, and I don't know how to punish it even. But I'm gonna try. Oh, okay. I'm not gonna try. I'm not gonna try. I'm gonna die. Well, I guess I tried. I just failed. <laughs> Right, yeah, she can do that. She can jump back. She's kind of like Blanca, right? Uh, in Street Fighter 6, she can like jump back and then ball like that. Fuck it, we ball, as it were. I don't want to be in the corner with the scary lady. Because she puts her spear in my face and I, I get reduced to atoms. Oh, thanks for the back throw. I'll, I'll take that any day of the week. Okay. Understandable. Have a nice day. Nice. We got the counter hit there, so we get the, the full conversion into a combo, too. Get down there. Uh, I'm gonna just not respect DP here. Oh, well, perhaps I should. There you go. Uh, if he can hit her with one more of those, especially when she's still in the corner like this, he's probably just dead. Oh, okay. Uh, am I dead? Doesn't this lead to, like, infinite damage when Zeta... Oh my god, am I okay? Am I, am I dead? Am I really for real dead? No. But damn, if it wasn't close. Am I right, fellas? Oh, she had the Blanca Ball thing again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fair enough. I should have seen that coming. It worked last time. I assume I can 2-H that, right? If I see it coming, of course. Um, it doesn't seem... I mean, maybe it's, like, incredibly disjointed, and therefore I cannot 2-H it, but I don't think so. It's just a matter of both of those times, I just wasn't really looking out for it at all. Okay, that was a pretty, that was a pretty custom confirm there, eh? That was pretty fun. Okay. Give me your bravery. Thank you. Get back in the corner, please. And then give me your life. It's just that easy, fellas. Anyone tells you Grand Blue Fantasy Versus Rising is a difficult game. Oh, it's so hard. Oh, I'm stuck in S+. Just raging strike them twice in a row in the corner, and it's a guaranteed win every time. I don't see the problem. Okay, that's fine. Little little counter action. You gonna do the thing where you jump back and blanca ball me? No, I'm just gonna run into your hitbox. Because... Oh, I see. That's like a little little tiger knee throw bait. I, was, I, wasn't, I wasn't even honestly like trying to use a throw to, to take a throw, but I just wasn't ready to block it. Owie! My face! Okay, understandable. Okay, understandable. Okay, understandable. Are you going to do the aura aura thing? Ah, oh, shit. Okay, okay. But the problem is, once you once you rob someone that hard with Raging Strike, they, they get a little wise. Oh, nice. We'll take that little stray hit that we got there. Uh, okay, so this is basically this next interaction here will be for game. Oh my god! Not what I expected at all. You got a spot dodge. Ah! <laughs> that was just, honestly... That was just a knowledge... I... I, I it was, it was a knowledge check if they didn't know it was unblockable. It was a reaction check if uh, they just... It was a weird option and like, oh, you gotta you gotta do this or you're gonna die. 
Either way, it was a bit of just... That's not like a great option necessarily. I mean, good players will... They'll, they'll beat that 100% of the time, right? But it's just more so that it was like, well, it was a scramble situation, right? Yeah, it's reactable. Yeah, you might even know what to do about this, but are you ready for this in like this weird time of the match? And luckily for us, the answer there was no. Sometimes you just got to call people out and say, I don't think you can block this right now. Oh, God, my, my command grab range. Not like this. Oh, nice. Well, I... I wonder, maybe she jumped there because she thought I was going to throw her, which is totally fair. I am still, uh, I was talking about in the last video, I do still want to try out this new close L, like kind of pick throw pressure. Ah, okay. Well, I, I, I tried, uh, but I, I did it a little too early. You have to wait a little longer uh, after block's done there to actually hurt people. Nice, nice. We've learned a little bit about her, her double overhead shenanigan read there. We guessed right on the mix, and now we are rewarded with a nice combo into super. Okay, Zeta, okay, let's see, what do you got here? You gonna you gonna let me reverse 2-1 you just like that? Nice. Oh god. That's fine. I actually would like to do the same thing back to you if it's all the same. Oh nice. Oh no. Okay. Oh, oh, it wasn't even super sky bounce. That's fine. That's also fine. That's also fun. What are you? What are you gonna do about it now? Huh? Nice. Just kind of uh, stared there and waited for her to flinch, and she did. Luckily. Yeah, it's like the you know she she used both of her brave counters, and I was like, well, I got one more. I got one more in the tank. I got a little bit more to give here. So that was nice. I feel like there wasn't so much playing like to playing against Zeta because I still. Don't, I haven't really acknowledged this, but Zeta is really rare for me. I think I think that was like the third or fourth Zeta I fought. Um, but in any case, uh, that, that was just kind of playing the, the player more than playing the character, because I didn't really know the, the character that well. But we still, we still did some stuff, right, with the double overhead shenaniganry, and we adapted to that, so I think that was a pretty well-played set by us overall. GG's to the opponent, and, uh, is this gonna be another match, or am I gonna cut you here? I think I'm gonna cut you here. I'll see you in the next match, guys. Oh, cool, another Vera. Alright, this is now kind of the opposite. This is a, uh, character that is a lot more common. I feel like I have a decent idea of what to- oh my god! I don't. I don't believe I've seen this before. She's got. She's got some. She's got some tempura action going on. All right. Word. Crazy that that does just as much damage as if uh, it was you know a giant magical uh, sword imbued with some like demon monster's energy. But I suppose you know real recognize real. I respect your hustle. Okay. There, I mean this person uh, immediately is uh, sure is DPing a lot. Huh? Oh damn. That was nice. I was. I was not expecting uh, command grab in that situation. Oh, okay, cool. We'll take a little stray hit here. This next hit, if we get it into... You gonna DP? Oh, well, similar, for sure. Oh, we didn't quite manage to get a, a proper punish on it. But I'm gonna grab you, and how does it feel to get reversal for once, huh? How do you how do you like it? How do you like it? Keep reversaling me, like you, like you don't respect any of my pressure? I could do it to you too, okay? I just, I try to be a little bit more civilized in these parts. I mean, not there's anything particularly belligerent about wake up DPing all the time. It's just, you know, it's it's an option. And I gotta if I if I don't if I don't like it, I gotta deal with it. Oh nice. We're getting a few stray hits here on this uh, Vera, but I did not manage to Whoa! I did not manage to convert off of that one, unfortunately. That wasn't even her 2H, right? That's like her her close heavy. Oh, that is nasty. Because then I can't match on that, right? I basically have to I have to jump or or die. Yeah, her! That's a really good anti-air considering it's not even her 2H. I'm I'm impressed. I think this is the first Vera that uh, I fought that's like used that so extensively. Okay, nice. I am plus there after the guard cross. If you didn't know, now you know. Uh, I'm going to assume DP here, honestly. You know, you know, I thought they would at least do it after I pressured them with something first. From what this player has shown me, I that was a mistake on my. I should have known they would have gone for it right away. That's that's on me. That's uh, just some some silliness. On my part there. Nice. Nice little stray hit there again. Okay, well, there's been a whole bunch of spaghetti going on in this corner, but you won't see me complain. Oh, okay. Another stray hit. We'll take it, and that'll be uh, that'll be the game there. That was a perfect? <laughs> that was maybe the messiest perfect I've ever had. Ah, a soul for a soul. I'm sorry.
the Vera heads back down to S and we head up to S plus three there. That's that's unfortunate, but that was again, yeah, maybe just like the worst I've ever played in a perfect. I feel like that happens to me a lot. There's a lot of times where I go perfect, but I, may, I did everything wrong. But it just so happens that, you know, either my opponent also did everything. Or, oh, yeah, that is a setup that Vera can do. I forgot about that. It's nasty. Yeah. Mm. OK, so you can just do that. That's like basically uh, guaranteed there. I cannot jump over that or I die. I kept thinking like maybe this time, but no, not this time. Nice. Bonk, bonk, beep, bop. This is a really hard round to win, but we can we can do our best. Oh, and you have to, mm, yeah. Oh, you know, right, yes. The the thing with her DP there is you have to spot dodge the second hit, right? Or uh, it's she's basically safe. I forgot about that. That's not something I think I don't think I've ever done. Like I know of it, but I don't think I've ever uh, pulled that off. So it's you know. You gotta do that once before it's really uh, in the cortex there. Okay, that time I did just see. I was ready. Why well, is yeah? That, that is just, it's a it's a really hard to fuck with kind of yeah. I mean you gotta you gotta not do that though. That's a really hard to fuck with anti air, huh? It's really quick and it honestly covers really huge spacing. I know basically the hard part is it's it's a close ace, right? So if he doesn't time it right, he's in trouble. What well, I did not I, th I thought I would at least be in block stun for a little bit there. I was not. Oh okay okay. Oh, that's unblockable. I'm a fool. Oh, I thought I, I thought that was uh, minus when she was maybe because maybe because she threw. Oh, owie, I'm dead, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice, nice, nice. Well done. Yeah, I thought uh, the oh, you know, I, I I'm gonna guess that what it is is you know throws are like frame four in this game, and I did a two M, which is frame seven, and I guess it just wasn't minus enough for that to really be a problem. It might be like minus two or minus one or something, I think, if I remember the uh, the actual frame data on that. He's got some uh, some nice quick buttons that he's... There you go. That time, though, come on, come on. You can't hit me with the same setup twice in a row. I'm dumb. I ain't that dumb. You gotta, you gotta give a, put a little bit more respect on my name than that. Oh, nice sort of last second reaction. I'll take that. This says, Vera has been getting hit with a lot of those sorts of stray hits off the headbutt, right? I, I assume maybe it's that they're... Uh, they're maybe jumping, right? They're maybe jumping, uh, expecting a command grab or something, but that's just not how I roll. Oh, <laughs> that's funny. The transformation into the DP immediately. Spickle. Yeah. I just, I mean, I just never jump at this Vera ever again, I think. Nice. Brave counter into 6XL. It's the, the Grand Blue Fantasy versus Rising Classic. <laughs> okay, so we both jumped there, but I super jumped, so it's not that I won the uh, the air-to-air -air necessarily, it's just that I went over what she was doing. That's funny. Okay, well, this is, uh, you're, you're in trouble here. And this is where your bad habits finally come to bite you in the butt. At the end of it all, at the end of all things, a DP punish stands there waiting for you. Alrighty, awesome, that was, uh... I feel like some some pretty decent. We, we learned something about Vera there too, right? Her close H is a is a really really strong anti air if you can time it properly uh, to the point where it'll go off and you won't get. I think that's her close H anyway. If it's her if it's her far H, no, it can't be. That just doesn't make sense. It doesn't have enough. The like far H is normally have a lot of horizontal reach, right? But we learned a little bit about Vera there. And we played really well, and now we're back up at S plus three. It's the highest we've ever been. So let's see if we can't uh, keep going onwards and upwards here. Oh, no cuts, no escape, no escape. You have to sit here and listen to me app all day. Oh, another Zed. Is this the same? Turtle, turtle. Uh, I don't think this is the same Zeta we were fighting earlier. Uh, I almost let the announcer trick me there. He's like Zeta, and I was like, yeah, it's Zeta. No, it's Zeta. If you say Zeta, I, I, as long as you like and subscribe, I'm okay with you. If you say Zeta and you neither liked the video nor are subscribed to the channel, then I hate you, and I think you, um, I don't know, should experience a mild inconvenience. Thoughts? Like something like, uh, what, what's a what? Yeah, that's my problem. Is I have no idea how to punish her her parry. Is it like 2H once once she goes up in the air? Or I mean, this this Zeta is using it enough. I, 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 the announcer almost got me. This Zeta, as it were, is using it enough that I'm probably gonna, you know, I'm either gonna learn or I'm gonna get rolled. So we're gonna we're gonna see. But I, yeah, I don't really know uh, what to do about her parry at all. Oh, she can do three even in the air. Okay, okay. Nice. Ex Blanca ball. Who do you think I am? Oh well, I think I'm. No, I'm not. I'm not dead. 
Surely not. Damn. Not what you want to do there. Uh, yeah, when she parries, do I 2H? I guess. Yeah, that's my my instinct, at least, but for some reason it doesn't it doesn't feel quite right. It doesn't feel like I'm gonna I'm gonna be happy when I try that, but. Oh, never mind. Okay, cool. No, it is definitely the right option. Got it. Good to oh god, good to know. Raging strikes? Oh, never mind. Bury my raging strike. What else? Oh god. Is this a combo? Whoa! Dude, this? You give this character a couple ultimate skills and they just combo from anywhere, huh? That's that's very impressive. Anyway, give me my bravery point back. Unhand me. Unhand me of my jewelry. I'll take one of yours, in fact, while we're here. Oh, Blanca Ball. No! After I talked all that good shit about being ready for it. Nice. There is there is some recovery on that move after all. Titans can bleed. Good to know. I mean, not that, not that, the, not that the quick recovery is what's strong about that move, but like, I was like, hmm, I wonder, like, if she does whiff that, like, is she super punishable? Like, is there a lot of risk involved for her there? I mean, that overhead is... I'm okay with this. You don't get a ton off of them. So, I'm okay, like, if that's gonna be her, her primary mix there, I'm not gonna be too upset. Oh, nice. Yeah, quick little uh, hit confirm in a can there with Raging Strike. Get back. Oh, no! I think maybe if they were doing an... Because I've definitely hit people with 2H on the other side of me. But I think maybe if, it's, you know, if they were doing, like, a real uh, aerial there, it would have extended their hurtbox a little bit and helped me out. He's gonna try and do some Zeta stuff to me here, so I gotta be careful. Oh, nice. Basically the exact same thing that happened the uh, last round, right? Well, we take those. Give me your life, please, Mr. Turtle. Bomb. Bomb. And three. Dude, I love the the ref. Like, I, I know if we've seen the Super Skybound art a hundred times by now, but I love that the ref just, like, he, like, jumps in. Like, he, gets, he comes from the top rope himself, bro. Zeta celebrating with the little Vern mask. We love to see it. Okay. Uh, or Zeta, Ladiva. Okay, my 2H was too late there, I suppose. I definitely tried 2Hing and I got hit out of the, the startup of it there, but happens. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. We, at least when she does the parry like that, we we have the tech now. We know what to do. Bonk, beat, bop, bop, and get grabbed. That is a nice little, like, it's, obviously it's not real, but that's just a nice little thing to, uh, to mess with people there. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. I suppose that's one way to beat Headbutt. I feel like uh, she took the damage and it like rolled her back out of it once it saw what had occurred. Oh, nice. Okay, but I'll take that. You, you give me the round, I'll, I'll take it. Like, uh, I saw her go red and some of the health went away, but then it rolled back to when it realized, oh, wait, oh, she reversal super. Damn, never mind. My bad, Mrs. Zeta. Again, it's Zeta, not Zeta. Oh, nice. Okay, yeah, yeah. Little, little wake up parry action. That's, that's fair and understandable, even. Again, I'm not particularly, yeah, that I should be more scared of, but the, the, the sort of the universal overhead there, I'm not particularly mad about. Oh, it's a nice combo. Nice! I haven't seen, like, a lot of characters bread and butters, so it's all just, you know, it's all still uh, just kind of fresh to me. I like it. Oh, no. Leave me alone. What the? Her back dash? Just like that? That's how we're going to do it? Okay, okay, okay. That's fine. Right, she was still in the uh, invulnerability frames of her backdash there. It's just tragic for me, really. That's fine. Well, it's not great, but it's fine. Oh, damn. Okay, okay. They were... They wanted the throw. I don't know... Uh, I got hit a couple times there, but I don't know if it's because I'm matching too... Oh, they missed a combo. Hoggers. Nice. Uh, I don't know if it's because, like, why they, why that combo dropped, um, or not why that combo dropped, why I got hit on matching there. I don't know if it's because uh, I matched too late or if that's just a frame trap, but I can't quite tell. I, it doesn't seem like a frame trap. I think I just, I waited, basically. They stared at me too long, and then I uh, did, did a stupid. Back to back. Oh, but you didn't have the second ultimate skill to back it up that time. You fool. Nice. 
Oh god, if I had just completed the auto combo, that would have killed. Yeah, well, they're gonna try and do some ultimate skill shenanigans here for sure. Right? Oh my, that was ambiguous, and I should have been hitting the guard button. I mean, we we literally had that match if I complete the auto combo, right? So, oopsie, uh, I suppose. That's fine. Can't be too mad about stuff like that. I tried to neutral jump there to punish the, the dash out, but it was not meant to be. This is fine. But I would have liked to have some corner pressure. It was, it was nice when I had corner pressure. I did. I liked it. I can't, can't jump there. Got it. Oh, okay. That's interesting. That was minus, but they covered it with the parry. That's understandable. Ow. This has just been a bad round, and they- oh, this has just been a horrible round. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fair enough. Understandable, understandable. Have a nice day. What the hell? Harry in, like, mid-screen like that? When I was nowhere- I, I suppose they wanted to use it to go airborne, but, like, it seemed ambitious, uh, at, the, at the very least. Oh, nice. That was, like, that's gotta be as meaty as that gets, right? I must have hit her with the very last active frame on that headbutt, it feels like. That was that was very well timed by me. Well done, me. Well done. Let me just pat myself. Oh god, I hit the mic, sorry. Let me just pat myself everywhere there, I suppose. I, I I'm ready for your Blanca Ball shenanigans. Oh, maybe I'm not. Well, I, I mean I was ready for Blanca Ball, I was not ready for headbutt. She's E Honda and Blanca in one. Yup, yeah, no, that's fair. That's not, that's, that's fair, man, I get it. Anyway, uh, sit down, please, sit down. Alrighty, uh, round three, the last, last game of the set here. Oh, let's see what we can, we can apply from what we've learned. Oh, cool. Oh, not cool. Damn it. I was kind of hoping you would have dropped that combo again like you did the one time. I couldn't 2H there? That's nasty. I don't know what's going on, but I'm not a fan of any of it. Uh, and I think it's going to kill me. Oh, he dropped. What? Can I block this in the air? Oh, nice. Well, don't have to even worry about that. Okay, well, I'm going to Super Skybound dart you, and then we'll get to a more interesting position in this match where we're a bit more uh, even here. Uh, I mean, I have to assume that they're going to parry, right? They've been doing it all the time, especially if I dash at them, maybe? No, not quite. Oh, that's awesome. I didn't have headbutts. Oh, I don't have the follow-up. Oh, this is horrible. You know, they've done two into anti-air there a bunch. I should have been more ready for that. I mean, I'm just, I'm just chipped here. This is the problem. Oh, I, I flinched first. I flinched first. That's fair. Yeah, you can have that one. I'll, I'll give it to you. I definitely... I flinched there. It's okay. Yeah, I mean... Obviously, I mean, the, the problem is that I was... Any special move there chips me, right? Like, because I... So, I, I did panic, but... That's okay. That's not That's not too bad. We'll take that. I mean, we probably... I, I think... The set just ends, right? If we... Uh, if we complete the auto combo in that one spot. So, overall, I'm still not too, too upset about that. We're seeing a lot more Zeta, though, as we get higher up here. Uh, Fairy. Oh, no. Okay, okay. So, our, the only thing that we learned with Fairy is that when we're at these kind of full screen distances where it feels impossible, we gotta roll. We gotta roll. Otherwise, my answer to Fairy is still kind of IDK tongue out emoji. Especially to this crazy cat who I, I despise with most of my being. Not all my being. He hasn't quite earned that level of ire from me yet. Okay, that's, yeah, understandable. Crazy Cat, I'm in Blockstone. Somebody help. Yeah, okay. No, that's that's fair. Stupid Crazy Cat. Nah, yeah, that close though, roll is not really uh, the move, I don't think. Damn it. That is a, that is a long ass normal if she's throwing out there. And even my dash decks are not far enough to really compete. Ow. Beppo. I mean, I'm just, I'm, I'm chipped almost here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, well, that's just, that's just not how we want the rounds to go, right? 
We don't want to give Fairy that kind of that kind of real estate, but sometimes it's tough, man. Wait. Oh, rolls are not. Yeah, yeah, rolls are like from knee up invincible or something, right? So if he's doing those lows, rolling is not even uh, the, the way to go necessarily. Okay. Oh, nice. I think that was probably uh, accidental there. I think that was supposed to be a brave counter, but we we'll take it. Oh, there you go. That's the brave counter that he was looking for earlier. That's fine. You can spend your, your DP there. Oh, damn. Nice spot dodge. Okay. What the hell? I don't think I've ever seen that. The little guy just, like, landing on my head. Yeah, yeah, fair. I guess I should have expected DP there, but I just... I kind of just wanted pressure, to be honest with you. I didn't want to... I didn't want to give it up. Whoa! Okay, well. That second round is a little bit better, but... Uh, fairy is definitely still Fairy. He's still definitely the character that I struggle the most with, I think. Um, so... Yeah, that low is just, it's like a full screen low. Uh, and it's very fast. I'm not really sure, because I can't roll through that. Maybe I, I mean, I feel like if I spot dodge, it's not like I'm going to gain any ground there. It's not like a super, a, a move with a super long recovery or anything. Okay, nice. A little bit of stagger pressure in the corner there ends up working out for us. I'm gonna accept expect the DP here. Oh, not quite. It's a brave counter. That's fine. You can spend 50 meter on that fairy. Ah, yeah, yeah, fair enough. I guess they were they were like waiting for that eagerly. Oh damn. That's a is that a frame trap? Or did I just I waited too long? I feel like I maybe could have matched there, but then I just Oh, I just got the instant overhead shenaniganry, of course. Oh baby! Okay. <laughs> I managed to react just in time with something there to get me uh, back to safety. Okay, 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 okay. We kind of steal around away from, from this fairy. That's fine. Let's see if we can't do another one. Great match, honey. Okay. We're in. It's official. We are no longer in because I, uh, I did 5H like a fool. How foolish of me. Yeah, I mean, at this point, I just, like, can't do that, huh? Uh, from... I, I got hit by the same uh, frame trap again, because I still thought maybe I could match, but... I suppose not. Is her close H? Is, is it plus or something? I'm not sure. Okay, nice. Um, yeah, I don't... Hmm. I don't know if that is actually... Again, because that time I still don't know. It didn't feel like, oh, well, I hit that as early as I possibly could, and I still got hit. So, like... I, what am I doing, man? Uh, yeah, this character just uh, freaks me out. For sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This character just freaks me out, uh, and I, I, I start doing silly things like that. Back-to-back -back EX clothes like that is... I mean, not only does it get me thrown for free, as we learned, because this fairy is very ready for it, it also just spends all my meter, right? It's really, really not the move. Oh, and the crazy cat's got me now. Oh, my. Oh, hello. I'm over here. Okay, cool. Uh, neither of those times that I did 5H, by the way, did I actually want to do 5H. I wanted to do Clothesline both times, but I suppose it's worked out. Get up there. Bonk, bonk. Get a little super in, and now it's uh, basically guess free game. I don't know if EX command grab kills here, but... Oh, well, that's a problem. I'm going to respect that now. Oh, God, the Brave Counter leaves her so far away. <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh, that was, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I went for a big risk with the sweep there just to see if I could kill her, but it did not work. Am I dead? I assume so, right? I got hit with a Super Skybound Dart with no bravery. Oh, okay, well. We got a potential chance here, but somehow we have to get in on this girl. Incredible! <laughs> I don't even know what to say. That is definitely not... <laughs> I, I was definitely... Uh, I think my odds of victory were very low after that Super Skybound Dart, but... We managed to... Luckily, the fairy was just passive enough that she kind of... She let me get in, in there and start... Dictating pace. 
a little bit. I, I, you know, that would not have been my bet though. If you, uh, I would not have bet that I win that one, for sure. I think they keep doing it back to back like that it makes me assume it's a frame trap, but they could also just be lying to my face, basically, because like I've been conditioned to believe that it is. Oh damn! Hello, GG. Welcome. Nice of you to join us. Oh, what the? Okay, okay. That time, I figured maybe they wouldn't be ready because they usually are safe when they're behind GG, but... that uh, The second time, though, not as surprising, right? Not as surprising the second time. Uh, yeah, uh, again, I was just kind of desperately trying to get in there, which I find is, is my uh, state of mind very often against this lady. Damn it, I can't, I can't roll through the low. Well, there you go. We got we got something off of a roll. The strategy is is still. Oh, I thought maybe I could jump over that, but no. That is a big big move. Oh oh. Okay, get up there. Well this. Okay, well. That was two pretty easy combos in a row that I flipped. Very unfortunate for me. Okay. Oh, damn. Okay, okay. Not like this, dude. That's tough. Oh, nice. I actually am blocking. Wait, but this is not... The super does not work the way that I thought it does, yeah. Unfortunate. It's not just, like, straight-up punishable like that. Damn it. I just... I couldn't... I, I, was, I knew that was going to chip me, but I just couldn't react fast enough. Yeah, man. Yeah, fairy. Uh, I still... I don't really know, uh, is, is, to be honest. Rolling is something, but I didn't even... That too... I think it's her too well. That sort of full screen lock. I can't even roll against that, so... That just seems like a very, very tough matchup that I'm gonna have to... Uh, probably just, you know, experience a lot more and, and probably lose in a lot more before we can really uh, get things going there, but... Okay, okay. We, we did a little bit of backwards progression there, but it's fun. Uh, had a little bit of a flub against the Zeta, and then obviously, I mean, Fairy just kind of beat me up. But we took one game, at least, I think. They're right. I th I'm like, I'm, I like completely zone out when the matches are happening, but I think we took one game there, which is nice. Uh, in any case, decent video, decent video. We'll see what we can do in the upcoming videos. But for now, as always, if you made it this far, I got three things for you. If you liked the video, and, uh, you know, I sure hope you did, get down there and like the damn video, man. Come on, it's free. It helps the channel out. Greatly appreciate it, of course. And it don't cost you nothing. Love don't cost a thing, as they say. And number two, while you're down there, that subscribe button, that bell button, they're right there. They don't cost anything either, and they'll keep you up to date with this uh, very long and long and long Grand Blue playlist that seems to be happening now as the Road to Master stretches out in front of us. But number three, of course, more importantly than anything, I had. I hope you had a great time hanging out today. Uh, I know I did. Even Again, even in those sorts of uh, confusing matchups, it's still a fun game to play, right, and try to puzzle things out. And... Uh, there'll be more Grand Blue coming at you soon, uh, and I mean noon EST, noon EST, new videos every day at noon EST until the heat death of the universe, hopefully. But until then, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.